Welcome to Three Mile Island Stadium in Steeltown, Pennsylvania. Today's forecast is going to be cool and breezy with nuclear lightning and intermittent chance of acid rain. So for those sitting in the stands, don't forget to wear your hazmat suits. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Crooks and Skull Jugulars battle the Blitzburg Steelheads. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. everyone grim blitzrow here along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones brickhead mulligan hey there was a reason for that i had to quit taking steroids my nutsack was shrinking and i sprouted this mini me on my shoulder that's junior eat me out you're a pussy First and ten. The deep looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. Man, guys like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Third down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Now this one's going to be tough. I hope he has a good enough leg for this one. I saw him trying one on before the game. He looked okay, I think. Not my type, though. A little too mutal. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. <laughs> Boom, dead. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Second down and seven. Oh, and he, oh, that's a big time hit. You ever been hit like that before, Bricks? Uh, have you seen my beer? And it's first and ten. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the key. And the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. Yeah, And 
And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. today <laughs> he was right third down and ten they pick up three on a short pass and this is going to be a rocket shot to the moon Check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. If they don't pick it up here, and they've had enough, the offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Watch out for those lightning strikes. They're killers. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. The offense will get it on the 20. First and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Brex. Uh, good night to that guy, Brex. You're an idiot. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Second down and a lot.
And it's first and ten. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better like Eskimos burying salmon heads. Kimchi. I mean, anything really tastes good. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. I personally think the ginormous guy is constantly. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Oh, I love the murder ball, Daddy Trick. And like Rick's balls, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, uh -oh he's talking about points. And he finds his target for two! <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. And it's first and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. Second down and ten. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. First and four. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8.
great. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Wow. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They had the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. First and ten. Now it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. That's a two-yard pass play, and that's not gonna get it done. The offense needs to move the ball upfield. Third down and eight. Oh, it's a punishing hit. Not many kickers can kick it over 50 yards in these brutal conditions. Let's see if he can do what few others can. That was like a movie trailer, Grim. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Point with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? <laughs> and it's first and ten. I had this guy. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. First and two. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. He goes. 
Rolls right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of... Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. Second down and two. First and ten. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. First and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. It's the two-minute warning. You know what that means? Whiskey? Second down in a lot. The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. That is still edible, though. Just got to sweep off the charge parts. Timeouts aren't just for offense, Grim. Well, they usually are, but sometimes the defense thinks they're helping out in their own special way. And that'll bring up third and one. <laughs> ah, another interception. Oh, what the brutal hit! The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, his head just exploded. First down and three. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. First and two. He is fought back, my friends. Was an all pro NFL hit. Second down and five. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. A timeout is called by the defense to stop the clock. They have one remaining. And that'll bring up third and one. The defense knocked a pass down, and quarterbacks hate that. The ref that just called that penalty, he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That's a, a good job. He's right at home here, taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swiping money from the bathroom attendant. Hey. 
Hey, who don't do that? First down and one. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's warming down his guy to the speed feet grip. He's running from his game. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Second down. And they take their last time out. It's between them and the clock now, Grim. Well, and the defense, too. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. There were any functioning brain cells before that hit. They're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. He refuses to go down. Oh, man. Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out on the field, they will have no running plays. First and ten. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point in the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. He could go all the way. He's at the 20. The 10. He scores! Wow, this is just horrible to watch. He looks like he's malfunctioning. Someone help him! He's just dancing, Bricks. Still probably better than I could. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. Yeah, as expected. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsanto Industries. Makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to begin, and if it's as much of a blowout as the first half was, we may see a riot in the stands. Oh, that's going to happen either way, Grim. It's a $1 Red Bull clap and vodka jello shot day. <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident it certainly does bricks it certainly does high five and it's first and ten he was stuffed at the line of scrimmage Second down and ten. 
Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and weep tonight. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. Normally that would be a first down, but he had a whole lot of ground to make up. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go! He's on... And he runs it in for the touchdown. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. This offense is rolling. Come on, Grim, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in bowling. Third down and three. And the defense gets another pick. Man, oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was. And he finds open space. He's running toward the end zone. Turn on you. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. First and ten. And that's another turn. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to made it the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, 
Oh, nice hit. Second down and inch it. And the defense goes for the jug. And in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and had only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. I don't think the funeral expenses that is. And it's first and ten. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. But I turned out the light, it wasn't wrong in my head. It was a chip. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. You can't keep Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. It's a brutal hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room straight through the uprights here comes the kickoff let's see if the defense can hold them he's gonna be able to run this one back i wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Second down and ten. and he picks up a... Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot! That's why we love the NFL! And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? 
second down and ten. takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. Oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. First and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. sure who he was throwing to on that play. Second down and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Third down and six. like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell here. It might be time to change the channel. I think Heidi's playing on Superstation WKRP. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> when in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. The is he dead? Uh, nah, he's still moving. Crap. I have money on him biting the big one. If he don't die soon, my loan shark is gonna kill me. And it's first and ten. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Second down, the size of Brick's wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Burners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Well, the 
should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. to try to conserve time. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. With the vicious kill! Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And he was stuck to him like glue. In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's mass stopsing time. That's right. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. The Blitzburg Steelheads decimate the opposition today and win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you I... shut the hell up right now? We go down the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every other...